related to things such as uh, sketchy motels on Lakeshore Avenue that used to exist there, and maybe some uh, slightly rundown apartment buildings. Hey everyone, I'm John DeFreitas. I'm a local real estate agent with Sutton Summer Realty, and today I'm coming to you from the village of Mimico. Look at that view in behind me, it's fantastic. Yes, I said Mimico, that uh, town that gets a bad rap for many reasons. Some are mostly stigmatized, related to things such as uh, sketchy motels on Lakeshore Avenue that used to exist there, and maybe some uh, slightly rundown apartment buildings. But I'm going to convince you that there are some really great spots in and around Mimico that you might want to consider moving to uh, real soon. So Mimico is located in the west end of Toronto. It's bordered to the easterly side by the Humber River Bridge, uh, which is a very well-known and, and famous bridge. Plenty of photographs taken around the city by that bridge. And to the west end by Kipling Avenue and Humber College, uh, which some of you may know is a well-known college uh, in around the city and is also location of some pretty well-known movies. Uh, one Academy uh, acclaimed movie being the 1980s movie, The Police Academy. So uh, I'm going to tell you about a few things in Royal Mimico that uh, should make it a desirable place to live. So first off, uh, Mimico's got a great commercial district in and off of Lakeshore Avenue. You've got plenty of shops, restaurants, cafes, conveniences such as drugstores. It's got an Eastern European flavor, so you get great delis, uh, absolutely great bakeries as well. Uh, Royal York Boulevard's also got some great shops and bakeries as well. You're going to want to visit that location as well. Uh, in terms of lifestyle, I mean, you can see in behind me, there you live on the lake. Uh, so it's got plenty of parks by the lake. Uh, it's got uh, some great schools, also many of them in the top quarter of the schools related to the Fraser Institute uh, ratings. So definitely a location in which you've got amenities, you've got parkland, you've got some great schools. What's another great reason to move into Mimico? Well, let me tell you, the actual price of housing in Mimico compared to the rest of Toronto is still relatively inexpensive, believe it or not. The average detached house in Mimico is going for about 1.4 million, uh, semi in about 1.1, and condominiums in around 900,000. Uh, so that's still relatively inexpensive. And the relatively high price of condos are likely because most of the views look like this. So it's very desirable from that perspective. And there's tons of development happening in around Mimico as well. Uh, the old Christie Cookie Factory uh, location, which many of you might be familiar with, that's been slated for redevelopment and it's going to be a 10 hectare park that will comprise of 15 high-rise condos. Uh, they're going to be adding a GO train station to that location. So transit in and around the area is already really good and it's just going to get better. Listen, Mimico is a great place to move to. It's still considered affordable. You've got lifestyle options. You've got some great schools, park settings. It's a location that you probably want to know a little bit more about. If you're looking to move into Mimico or looking to relocate, this is an option you want to consider. Give me a call. I'm John DeFreitas, local real estate agent, again with Sutton Summer Realty, and I'd love to talk to you a little bit more about it. Catch you next time on another great neighborhood. Bye, everyone.